guys, Leslie here, running with Craft Scissors. So let's go ahead and pick up where we left off in my end of the year planner flip through for my Erin Condren for 2023. So we left off on this spread from Tilly B Plans. It's a sunflower spread with a little bit of mixed other flowers and a dragonfly. <laughs> and then this kit is from Planner Sister Stickers. It's a very tropical kit with the tropical drinks and it says island coffee and everything. And then we have the next week, July 24th through the 30th, I did the strawberry kit from Plan Planning in Blue Jeans. <laughs> Planning in Blue Jeans strawberry kit. And then this one, so we go back to school in August, so I did um, the crayons on the top and the bottom. And then Hope got the girl with the phone. Miranda got the girl in the polka dot dress with a ruler and curly hair. And then Lori got the girl in the yellow dress with the clipboard and wavy hair and purple glasses. <laughs> so I hope you guys like those. Mindset is everything. There's a little llama. And then um, Planner Sister Stickers did sunflowers for the August theme. Love that. Um, you can tell when I went back to work because then there's like no videos. <laughs> All right. Never use that page. Do I, here's the sunflower weekly kit that matches the monthly kit. They always do a weekly kit that matches the monthly kit. So if you're ever wanting to like pair it up then, or you just really like it and you want the design twice, then that works too. So planner sister stickers on that one. This one is also planner sister stickers. I did a watermelon spread for the week of my father-in-law's birthday. Watermelon is his favorite. There's even a watermelon cake. <laughs> I usually make him a pineapple upside down cake, which is funny because usually it's been like, I don't know, only like a month, month and a week since my husband had one for his. So this one is the like, it's a reading spread. <laughs> and this one is from Planner Sister Stickers as well. So you've got two girls in the library and then you got another girl like looking for books over here on the shelf. I really favored the double boxes in this spread and that's what made it kind of unique and fun. This tape I believe is from the washi tape shop and it's sparkly and it has butterflies and roses. And I thought the color scheme went, went well, <laughs> went well with the spread. All right, this one, back to school spread from Planner Sister Stickers. I like this one. It had a variety of, like, teachers, students. Um, I will say I think this one is probably, like, a high school student or a middle school student, and then this one kind of came across as, like, the teacher to me. So I don't know about you. And then you have, like, little kids going to school too. And then we have for this September, I did a coffee theme. I forget where these were from. They were on a little sampler. So I'm sorry, I don't have that shop name anymore. Um, I did a bag of coffee that says hello for Miranda. And I did a cup of coffee that says, but first coffee with a little bow for Hope. And then I did a stack of donuts for Lori. <laughs> and then there's like a little raggedy doll there. And then I used my coffee washi tape, which I got years and years ago. There was like a planner kit subscription thing. And then this is the monthly kit from Planner Sister Stickers. September, they went with like the fall leaves. And then I have my Silly Holidays from um, Sweet Kawaii Design. So you guys can see those. And then decorated, used. So that's good. <laughs> um, I wrote two things I want to work on. More videos and a new schedule. So that's, I think, around when I start doing every other week new releases. This is the Harry Potter Hogwarts theme kit. I would say more Hogwarts theme because it's not like all about Harry. Um, so I have a Hogwarts kit for August 28th through September 3rd. Yeah. And this kit is from Caffeine Queens. And then I think that might've been the kit I had trouble peeling up. I think that's true. All right. And then this one, oh boy, I missed this shop. Oh, fabulously planned. I think that's that's this kit, Fabulously Planned. That was another one, Fabulous. Okay. I thought I would make a list at the in the description of like all the shops that I used, so that'll be helpful. <laughs> so I did a coffee theme spread. I brought in that coffee washi again. I thought since they were both half boxes, I would just continue the coffee washi, so I thought that would be fun. And then this kit is from Tilly B Plans. It's a pumpkin patch farm kit. I thought it was adorable. I love the different pumpkins. And then this kit is from Planner Sister Stickers. It has the little like sign and it has a hedgie. And then look, there's another little like Labrador looking dog like mine. So she's there and there and then over there. I grabbed all of them. <laughs> and she's on this one too. <laughs> so beautiful fall day spread. 
Okay, we're going into Halloween. I grabbed these stickers. They're from Caffeine Queens. It was the freebie that went with the kit that I bought. I think I bought during a Harry Potter sale or something. So it's like, this one's a quote. This one's just like other things. Yeah, <laughs> or other quotes. This one I don't think is a quote. <laughs> Anyway, and then Halloween, since it is going to be October. So Hope got, I think it's Chip, trick-or-treating. And then Lori got a haunted house with the three characters from um, Sweet Ava's Paper. And then Miranda got Chip um, being a vampire and trick-or-treating. That's not Chip. I think that's the Corgi, but I forget the Corgi's name. All right, and then October, they, they did kind of like a... It's kind of a pinky orange <laughs> for October. And then I have my silly holidays, of course. Favorite one is Black Cat Day. <laughs> and then never use these pages. <laughs> and then this weekly kit is from Tilly B Plans. And then the washi is Simply Gilded. This was a throwback to how I used to do my spreads. Um, I think I did that a couple of times in this one. Um, I like the quote. I actually made it into a paper clip. It says she leaves a little sparkle wherever she goes. And I also have that quote hanging in my office. I think I found it at Hobby Lobby. <laughs> so Cinderella kit. And then this kit is from Planner Sister Stickers. It's a football kit. Um, we watched a lot of football this year. We're still watching. So <laughs> there is that. But I thought this one was a good one because it wasn't too heavy on um, which team it was supporting because sometimes you run into kits where it's just like the team is really evident now I will say I like the red because my family usually roots for the Chiefs so I'm fine with it <laughs> but the green and brown are just traditional like field colors so um, maybe there that might be an 87 <laughs> I'm just kidding <laughs> all right this kit is a fall critters kit from Sweet Kawhi Design there's a sticker that says hey there pumpkin um, her double full boxes don't completely full fill each side. I'm not sure why. It says I ordered the vertical neutral, but I don't know. And then I put the the little beaver right here too. Love the bottom washi. And then I grabbed some um, that gingham graph paper washi and put it down there at the bottom as well. I did order um, her favorite pen to use on her stickers. I did go ahead and order it on Amazon, so I'll let you guys know. Probably do an unboxing and pen review. This one is a kit from Tilly B Plans. So cute. Love all the pink. So it's kind of a pink Halloween kit. I used a lot of different washi tapes. So that was really fun. And then this one <laughs> is from Planner Sister Stickers. And I like this one because it was um, kind of like, I was like, what is this from? And then I was like, I think it's from Sleeping Beauty? I'm not sure. And so I just kind of liked it. It was kind of a creepy princessy kind of vibe. <laughs> All right. And then for November, I did um, some fall foxes down here at the bottom and then my leaf washi. And then I just used the big letters and then wrote their names in cursive. So I have Lori, Hope, Patricia, and Miranda that month. Um, this one says Serenity comes when you make peace with your present. So maybe that needs to be my word. I'm seriously thinking about choosing my word from these dividers. <laughs> November monthly spread is kind of like a rainy fall from Planner Sister Stickers. And then you guys can see my silly holidays are in here. I like the Small Business Saturday and Princess Day. That's a good one. <laughs> never use those pages. <laughs> so it's like I never use but sometimes use. <laughs> Um, this was a very slow week. I didn't do new releases, so there's a bunch of eggs right there. Um, but this one was the week of Halloween, and it was just really busy. And so I think I didn't even, I didn't end up doing new releases that week. So that was kind of part of it. Everybody gets busy with the holidays, too. I really want to figure out how to make those spider cookies. Those look fun. And then this is another fall spread from Planner Sister Stickers. It's kind of a fall at home spread. Um, I liked how I put Veterans Day in the wreath. I hope you guys can see that. It's foiled in there. I added that, and I thought it looked cool. And then um, I love the living room spread. I definitely decorate my house for fall and for Halloween. This one was to commemorate um, us celebrating another year in our house. Um, so we are at two years. Are we? Where did the time go? <laughs> That's what happens when you move at the end of a year. Because <laughs> I was like, wait, What? <laughs> Yeah, I think it's been two full years now. <laughs> we literally get mixed up all the time. So it's a home kit, um, and it is from Planner Sister Stickers. And then this one is from Planner Sister Stickers as well, and it's a football 
it's a it's a Thanksgiving football spread. So I appreciated this one because we actually we I think we did play on Thanksgiving, so it was kind of fun. Yeah, we played on Thanksgiving and Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year, something like that. It was crazy. Anyway, we did watch football, so that was fun. And then this is um, the December divider. There's power and kindness, and then I have a bunch of deco. Uh, I think that's from Sweet Ava. And then, so the stickers for this one, Miranda got the Christmas tree, pine cone, and candle. Lori got the snowman and the snow globe. Hope got the Connie and coming out of a present. And Patricia got the peppermint candy cane heart coffee. <laughs> and then I put a sticker down here that says all I want for Christmas is stickers and then mistletoe kisses. <laughs> and then I use some of my wide washi that I never get to use because <laughs> it never fits in my spreads. <laughs> And I don't remember where those came from, but it was from a freebie sheet, like a little sampler. All right, and then this is from Planner Sister Stickers, and you can see all the silly holidays. I like Pastry Day because I was definitely watching, like, Great British Bake Off Christmas edi Edition and stuff. And then we had to look up a bunch from this one because we had to look up Noodle Ring Day. I remember that. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> and then we talked about fruitcakes, and I was like, have you ever had one? Like, I don't know. I never have. <laughs> And then there's Bacon Day on the 30th. We should we should definitely write that down. Used, which usually I don't. So <laughs> we should look at how many times I actually, like, have used these pages. <laughs> so I wrote down my ideas for New Year's, um, ideas for some winter, and then a to-do list, and then a YouTube to-do list. And I used some of the baking leftover Christmas baking stickers and even the quarter boxes from Sweet Quiet Design. This kit is from Planner Sister Stickers. It's that blue snowman kit. Love the cupcakes and coffees, merry and bright. Like, it was just really beautiful. I loved how, like, the lights looked on the snowy Christmas tree. It was just really adorable. This one is from Planner Sister Stickers as well. This one matches the monthly kit. Love that double full box of the little house with the lights in it and lots of candles. You could, like, smell the cinnamon pine cones in this spread, right? <laughs> So there you go. And then this one is also from Planner Sister Stickers. And I hurried up and used this one because it did come a little late, like close, getting close to Christmas. So I pulled it out of the stack because it had all the Christmas movies in it. It had the Santa Claus and it had um, Lampoon Christmas Vacation and then it had Home Alone. And so I was like, I have to use this one. <laughs> and then it says Christmas Movie Marathon. We definitely watched a lot of those. And then I was able to squeeze in some washi here and there. So this one was a fun spread. And then, oh, yeah, some of the deco included Buddy the Elf and Grinch. That's why I was like, no, I got it. I got to use this. So I love that one. Um, we always bake for the holidays, and we usually bake right up close on Christmas so we can enjoy our Christmas treats all day on Christmas. Um, and this is from Sweet Quiet Design, <laughs> as you guys can see. Um, I put the little cookie sheet over here with some cookies on it, and then I did an old school spread with hers. I felt like it just worked better for doing the freestanding checklist to do it this way um, and be able to use some of that washi. So this washi is from Carpe Diem, and then this washi I think is from a tube from Michael's, and then the bottom washi is from the actual kit. So adorable. And then this kit, I think this becomes my last spread. Um, I used Tilly B Plans. Um, I, like I said, I got sick after my nail appointment. <laughs> so <laughs> crazy time. Um, I think that's actually, yeah, that's when I went and got these done. So it's almost time for a new set. <laughs> um, I ended the year really well for sales that week. So thank you. Um, and this kit, like I said, is from Tilly B Plans and it has that like um, stained glass look to it, kind of like the sunflower kit. So not all of her kits are like that. Obviously I've showed you some other ones. Um, and then the washi tape is really fun. I actually got to use some of that wide washi tape with the holly. Love that vintage washi tape as well. I don't usually use my note pages, but I will show them to you and how blank they are. Um, I don't have meetings to attend or anything like that in here. So, I mean, I could doodle in here, some sketches if I wanted to. Um, I don't keep my contacts in here. There's the holidays. I don't plan the next year that far in advance. And I never use these stickers. <laughs> so, <laughs> um, I really should keep the happy birthday stickers. I feel like I'm always running out of happy birthday stickers. Uh, but everything else will probably go in my D stash pile. I did throw around the idea of this year forcing myself to do a plan with me only using the stickers that come with the Erin Condren. <laughs> but usually I order the neutral and they just look so bland. <laughs> so 
but I end up not. I do utilize the sticker pocket only. I use it and then I forget what stickers I put in there. So I have taken them out. Um, and then this is just the back page so you guys can see that. But I was curious to see. Okay. So we used it for December. Um, not November. Not October. <laughs> September, I would say use. So we're up to two months where I use that one. Nope. <laughs> um, I would say that's used. So we're up to three. And then four. Okay, not so bad. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Uh, no. Uh, no. <laughs> so I only used four out of 12 months of these pages, which is why I can't justify ordering those um, overlays from Sweet Kawhi Design for those. <laughs> um, so I'd love to know what your favorite spread, um, I guess, of July through this one. I would love to know which one was your favorite. And then um, for all the shops that I used, um, I would say, okay, so I used Lilac, it's like Lilac Paper Co., um, the Craft Penguin Planner, Planner Sister Stickers, Tilly Bee Plans, Caffeine Queens, Beyond Paper Flowers, Planning and Blue Jinx, Nightingale Paper Co., Sweet Kawhi Designs, and Fabulously Planned. So that's how many shops I featured. I do know that I heavily use Planner Sister stickers. They hook me up with a lot of stickers, and it's kits that I always really like, so I'm going to use them. Because um, I have gotten the question before where they're like, are you going to use a bunch of, are you going to use more shops in your planner? And I'm like, yeah, like as I see fit, like <laughs> I'm not going to force it, but I mean, yeah, <laughs> but it gets expensive to order from that many different shops because every time you order from a different shop, you have to pay shipping like every time. And so if you have one shop you want to order from and order a bunch of your kits from, then you're only paying one shipping. So like I totally get it as far as like making planning more affordable. I'm just kind of flipping through, but I would love to know in your comments what your favorite spread was um, for the whole planner. That's always fun. I feel like we tend to lean towards like our holiday faves um, or anything like that, <laughs> but really cute. Love the little fox mug there. That's adorable. All right. So there you go. That is my planner for the Erin Condren for 2023. And it is now time to put this baby away. So thanks for watching and subscribing and sharing my videos and keeping up with me this year. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.